The southwestern realm of Rivenborn is peaceful. The villages are simple agricultural communities. Disputes are between neighbors or predators and livestock and are handled civilly. From forest to fields, the corrosion of war has never been felt. The oldest city in this region, home to the High Elves, is a veritable paradise. It is here in Misglade that an adventure is about to unfold. While visiting Misclade, our hero gets bored and goes exploring. He discovers a hidden room beneath the abandoned library with the remnants of a failed ritual. Sensing the dark secrecy, he confronts the recluse wizard Quetzal, who tells him what happened. Long ago, five elves unraveled the mysteries of magic. Their research culminated in a spell to bring peace and protection to their forest by calling on the forest demigod, Uruvit. When preparing the spell, however, the wise elf Quetzal refused to take part, urging the others to abandon the experiment. In the end, they were swayed by Niku, and the foursome performed the spell without Quetzal. Niku corrupted the spell, invoking Vilash, the gatekeeper of the afterlife, rather than Puravit. Niku intended to control Vilash, and thus control who lived and died, but the spell brought Vilash into the mortal realm, dooming the elves. Our hero learns only that Niku became very powerful after the summoning, but does not learn the truth. That Niku lost all agency that day, and became the slave lieutenant of Vilash. The three other mages were ensnared by Vilash, but are much less powerful. There was Zylo, Bane of the Sky, Totek, the Firebrand, and the last was Tazad. Our hero is not told her name, because there are none alive who remember it. Niku left the forests around Misglade, and established his realm in the massive marsh to the east. Stories say he practices his dark magic from a lavish castle somewhere near the center. Quetzal went on to build his tower and continued studying magic on his own. He invented Elytra and even made the hill his tower is built on hover. As so many resources were delved from it to build the tower, it could hardly withstand its own weight. He advises the Misclade elves occasionally, counseling them to use watchtowers to protect the forest rather than magic. Before our hero starts his quest, Quetzal gives him the powerful sword, The Truth Untold, which contains the unworking spell that could banish Vilash from Rivenborn forever. Forever.